literally hurt my soul. <laughs> from people 11 days 11 days oh my goodness this trick literally hurt my soul like i i can't begin where do i begin all right so trailer from feeble the first day i landed it really sketchy and it wasn't until the the fifth or sixth day that i landed again like weirdly and then the seventh day, I landed one with hand touch. And then the two days later, the, on the ninth day, I landed another one identically to that one. And then the eleventh day, yes, we skipped from nine to eleven because day ten just didn't work out. It was bad. Um, day eleven, I went in the morning. First time going in the morning for that trick, and no one was there, which was great. I was distracted by little kids, but. I overpowered it once they left. I started getting more focused again, and that helped out so much on on a huge level. Uh, what happened was I was focused, and I was able to get in. I started getting in really good, and then I ate crap, and it hurt my back because, like, I had a scab there. So I just kind of jumped out and yelled, ah! But... Within a few tries afterwards, I just landed it. It felt so crazy, like... Like finally, finally, what I was thinking finally happened. And, and this was the first day where I started picturing how I wanted it to flip and go into the, the front feeble. So let me explain something. When I tray flipped, I, I didn't do my best to tray flip hard. Like it's, it may sound weird because the footage says something else, but to me, it felt very controlled when I flicked and popped and then just kind of directed it into the front feeble. And then when I landed it, I felt the front feeble and I like like felt my foot dipping and then I landed it. And when I landed it, I was so surprised and shocked. And it was crazy because like no one was filming me. So it was directly, it was angled directly at the camera. So like I rolled away into the camera. It was crazy. Like, oh my gosh. I just want to say that for this trick, it was insane because it's a square rail, so you have to get in a certain way. It's not like a circle rail. I feel like with a circle rail, if I would have got in, I could have kind of like forced it into a front people. But with this, it was a square, and it was like kind of you have to get in a certain way for the front people. But hey, made it happen. Um, the biggest challenge for this trick was literally like the the people around the because you you're sharing the skate park. 
uh, the kids because like they're running wild and they're like distracting you. Other than that, it was just a matter of persevering and not giving up. Like the last day, like day 11, I really felt crazy. Like I felt crazy in the sense of like, I kept talking to myself, telling myself we're not giving up. Like I want, you know how easy it is to give up? You could just say, I'm going to come back another day. That's how close I was. But I said, no, I'm doing it. And I did it. So that's it. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, and sign on. Until next time.